meets colorful King Levinsky. Let's listen to the ringside announcer Dan Toby introduce the celebrities. In round one, Bear moves out in dark trunks. King Levinsky is in light. This is the second time that these two men have met. They previously fought six months ago in January of this year in New York City. Bear scored a hard-fought 10-round victory in that one. Today, though, Levinsky hopes to reverse that decision, preferably by knockout. The last time Bear fought in Reno on July 4th, 1931, exactly a year ago, he lost a decision to Paolino Uscudon. A good right by Levinsky. Bear tries to keep his man off with that long left jab. Wild slugging here in round one. That's the end of the round. In rounds two through six, the men fought on even terms. Here in round seven, both men are giving up on caution, looking to land that one big bomb. Max Bear is 23 years of age, a year older than King Leminski, but he began his professional boxing career in 1929, one year later than King. Bear has had 43 professional fights, 26 which he ended with a knockout. Most of Max's KOs are sudden, one-punch blockbusters. This fight is scheduled for a long 20 rounds. A good crisp right by King Levinsky. Bear charges in there with that left. There is very little caution in Max's style. A good sharp right by King Levinsky.
And there's the end of round seven. In rounds eight through 11, the men fought evenly as they continued under a scorching Nevada sun. Here in round 12, it's beginning to be a test of stamina. This is the fifth bout this year for both men. Aside from defeating Levinsky previously, Bear stopped Tom Heaney, Walter Cobb, and Paul Swiderski. Levinsky beat Paolino Oskudan in 10 rounds in Chicago, but lost to Mickey Walker. King also fought an exhibition of four rounds against former heavyweight champion Jack Dempsey. King had the Manasseh Mauler reeling at the end of that one. Clubbing right by Max Bear here in round 12. Max is still trying to take King out of there. Both men appear to be tiring here in the 12th round. sensational flurry of dynamite punches by King Levinsky here at the end of the 12th round. In rounds 13 through 19, neither fighter was able to take over. The sweltering sun was doing as much damage to both men as their punches. This is the 20th and final round of this grueling fight. For Levinsky, this is King's first bout that has ever gone beyond 10 rounds. Bear has fought one 20-rounder previously, which he lost to Paolino. Max still going after King Levinsky here in round 20. Jolting left by the King. Both men pouring it on here at the end. Here at the conclusion of one hour and 15 minutes of slugging under a blistering sun, Max Bear is awarded a grueling 20-round decision over a tough, rugged King Levinsky.